So are we alone in the universe? Maybe, but I think not, and here's why. So the image you can see is the Andromeda galaxy. It's about 2.5 million light years away, and it's larger than our own galaxy, the Milky Way galaxy. So the image looks like a cloud of dust, right? And that's exactly what the early astronomers thought. They just assumed that it was a, a cloud of gas and dust, or a nebula in space. But in fact, we now know that this is a galaxy. Every speck of light you can see in this image is another star. So the image itself is a mosaic image taken by the Hubble Space Telescope back in 2015, and it's a super high resolution view of the Andromeda galaxy. So if we zoom in, you can see just how many stars there actually are in this galaxy. Approximately a trillion stars in this galaxy alone. Now consider that many of these stars are going to have planets of their own. Our star has got eight planets, plus a number of dwarf planets, and assuming this is typical, we can expect to find trillions of planets in this galaxy alone. How many of those planets are going to be like Earth? How many of those planets will exist in the habitable zone and have an oxygen-rich atmosphere and liquid water? Surely many thousands, perhaps hundreds of thousands, of planets that can support life as we know it. How many of these planets could actually contain life? And how many will contain intelligent life, like you or I? We would view such life as aliens, and they would view us as aliens as well. Now look at this image. So this is another image taken by the Hubble Space Telescope. Uh, and this image was captured by looking at a region of the sky with apparently no stars in it, so completely empty space. Now the image is a view of an area of sky that would occupy the same area of sky as a tennis ball would occupy if it were 100 metres away. They left the telescope looking at that patch of sky, and when they collected enough light, this is what they saw. So you might assume that they, this image just shows lots and lots of stars. Well, you're half right. The image is actually showing galaxies, each with millions, billions, or trillions of stars. Thousands of galaxies in this image alone, occupying an area of sky no bigger than a tennis ball 100 metres away. Thousands of galaxies in this image alone, uh, 2 billion galaxies in the entire universe. How many billions of stars are there in each of those galaxies? And how many planets supporting life exist in the universe? How many of those planets supporting life are home to intelligent life, perhaps looking up and doing exactly what we're doing, they're looking up and exploring the universe. So it's impossible to know how many intelligent life forms exist in the universe or have existed in the universe, but surely we are not the only intelligent species in the universe.